Aquaman 2 has reportedly been awful. It's gone through three sets of reshoots and now some massive updates. This is Digital Shark Goodery. If you are looking forward to Aquaman 2, The Lost Kingdom, or anything coming up in the DC Universe, check out that subscribe button and feel free to Hulk smash the like. Aquaman 2 has gone through many reshoots and some people who have seen test screenings have claimed that it is the worst DC film they have ever seen. Whether this is true or not, reports are coming out now that James Gunn actually oversaw the last group of reshoots. This is massive news for a series of reasons. Reason number one being Jason Momoa could in fact be a part of the DCU as Aquaman. Obviously Lobo is something in there. Could he potentially be, play both Lobo and Aqu Aquaman? Maybe. But James Gunn coming in, he has a vision. He knows how to create something out of nothing and maybe that is how he's doing it and Aquaman will remain Jason Momoa. The other big thing going on on in this one is Batman has been removed. As far as we know, Michael Keaton Batman and Ben Affleck Batman will no longer be a part of Aquaman 2. If you remember, if you recall, Michael Keaton filmed a end credit scene for Aquaman 2 and it was removed and then it was replaced with a Ben Affleck Aquaman 2 cameo which Jason Momoa was very excited for. If you were, this was about a year and a bit, I think it was last fall they shot this. Jason Momoa was very excited. Ben Affleck was back and it seemed like this was happening. The reason why both of these have been cut, no one can get their hopes up to see either one of these Batman on screen again. Michael Keaton's Batman was wasted in the Flash. I mean, the, whatever you think of the Flash, it kind of, it, it is depressing to know that his last setting as Batman was such a failure financially. And Ben Affleck, that will also, that Flash movie also be his end. So the Flash is the end of the DC EU, which means Aquaman, the reshoots could be bringing Aquaman into the DCU correctly. It could also be, as James Wan said, a very separate film from all the other ones. It's its own entity, its own piece of art. And so if that's the case, then it could be acting like a blue beetle where the character exists in the DCU, but the movie kind of exists on its own. What do you guys think of these new reshoot reports from Aquaman 2? Are you going to go see it whenever it comes out? December, I think. If that's still the date, let me know in the comments down below. And until next time, may you be the master of your own universe.